Good morning, Sweet Home. Today is Monday, February 6th, and it's a day two. My name is Elena Zilsberger, and here are today's morning announcements. This week's artist is sophomore Ella Hubert. Ella is currently taking 3D mixed media. Ella designed this incredible gingerbread house completely on her own. While all of the designs were stunning, Ella's use of interesting materials really stood out. Congratulations, Ella. The next Unified Club meeting will be Monday, February 13th in room 613 right after school. We'll be taking our yearbook photo too. Must have owned transportation home at 315. The Unified Bowling team won their first match against West Seneca five games to four. The highest scores contributing to the big win were Caesar Nance and Mackay Glasgow Thomas. The team is back on the lanes next Wednesday at Holland. Go Panthers! Students interested in participating in a spring sport may now sign up through final forms. Directions to register may be found on the district's athletic website. Please stop down to the athletic office with any questions. Seniors who have committed to participate in college athletics must stop down to see Mr. Schemo in the athletic office this week. Katherine Johnson worked for NASA from 1953 to 1986. During that time, she was instrumental in developing the flight trajectories that enabled human spaceflight at its very inception. Her calculations were known for their accuracy and speed, as well as their innovative approach to using geometry. Ms. Johnson was a crucial piece of John Glenn's first orbital mission in 1962. In 1967, her expertise and original thinking allowed novel uses for geometry, laying the foundations for the first human mission for the moon to be a success. Katherine Johnson continued to be a groundbreaking mathematician and computer scientist by linking up NASA's satellites to an IBM system of computers. This linkage eventually became what is now known as the Global Positioning System, or GPS, we rely on today. Her life was put to screen with the motion picture Hidden Figures, and she was given the Presidential Medal of Honor by President Obama. Katherine Johnson passed away last February, on February 24th, 2020. 